created her. Now we are looking at the, uh, can we have these uh, endoscopic as well as the US, can, are you seeing the US picture? Are you seeing the US uh, images? Saad? Yes, we are seeing the US. Oh, okay. So we are going to identify those structures. Yeah. Uh, okay, so we can uh, freeze that. So uh, let me explain this a little to you and then you can go through that. Okay. Uh, so uh, it's not a basically here we go. So uh, can you freeze that please? Please. Please. All right. Uh, arrow. Right. So there was a request that we should uh, freeze the pictures and explain that. So this is the mitral valve here. This is the left atrium here, and this is the left ventricle here. Okay. So next. Yeah. Uh, yeah. I just withdrawn the scope a little. Rotate it at freeze, please. This is the aortic. This is the aor uh, ascending aorta here. Uh, you will see the pulmonary artery here. Okay. And as I rotate it further, you can see the pulmonary trunk here. Please, please. Uh, no, uh, we have a sign function. off uh, cursor. Okay. So, yeah, here we go. Uh, we have a cursor on. Okay. So, from this, the pulmonary artery you saw here, you will have this pulmonary trunk coming like this and going right here. Okay. So, this is the pulmonary trunk. Unfreeze, and as you you can, I'll show it again. Keep your eyes on the pulmonary artery, and see when I rotate it to the right a little. If you look at my hands, and you will start seeing the pulmonary trunk here. Okay, just hold it. Right. Now, again, if you rotate, if you can, you can see this uh, freeze. Kijaga? Yeah. So here you can see this is the aortic. Uh, this is the aorta here. These are the sinuses. These are this is the aortic valve here, and this is the left ventricular outflow track here. All right. So as we turn further right, I'm going to just quickly explain this so that. All right. Here we go. Right, freeze kijaga. Okay, so this is the superior vena cava here, and this is the right atrium, and this is the inferior vena cava. This is the diaphragm showing here. This inferior vena cava will trace back into the liver here. So this is the right side uh, of the heart. So this is the again superior vena cava, right atrium, inferior vena cava. So. As we go down, you can see this, we will trace this into the, there you can see, this side to the table, so all right. So right, there you go. So can you see the inferior vena cava now going into the liver and the hepatic veins are entering the? Inferior vena cava here. So, in between the vena cava, can you freeze that? Cursor off ki jayega. All right. So, cursor on. So, you have these hepatic veins entering into the inferior vena cava. In between the cava and the transducer is the segment 1. This is the caudate lobe here. And the, uh, and in between the cava, in between the caudate lobe, the inferior vena cava, and the middle hepatic vein, you have segment 4. All right. So, from here, uh, Dr. Khalid had asked me to again uh, uh, look at the so, if you turn, uh, look at the aorta, so what we are going to do is, if you look at my hand, we are going to turn it right across here and 90 degrees and we are on the aorta here. So, once we are on the aorta, we push a little bit and 
follow the freeze ki jagah so this is the cross of the diaphragm this is the celiac and this is the superior mesenteric the first branch which you see which goes up and goes towards the uh, cranial end of the patient is usually the right gastric uh, the la the one which starts going after division going down would be the hepatic and the one which goes forward is the splenic arch can you is it done yeah so now if you follow that here the celiac and you can see it dividing here it's going into this forming a splenic artery and then of course you can see the hepatic going down and the right gastric going you can't see it very clearly but it's going up and you can follow the splenic so from here if you just turn sorry but we have to issue one more is about time i need to give about the maximum 10 to 15 oh, minutes and do so you need to give the camera ji ma kanal dekh lo ha ji maine sirf uska spin okay so we are going to as you turn here we can look at the kidney and we will look at the spleen right there you go so that's with a quick what we already done right so you can you see that wherever you want us to freeze and we can explain that to you go forward so you can see the ring down shadow that means there's an air in between so suction constant suction tape up get an image there all right there you go so you can follow the vena cava here so now turn yourself to the right 90 degrees from here go on to the aorta yeah keep on turning keep on turning keep on turning yeah we go yeah turn a little left again keep the aorta in view there you go so just straight in the up down wheel a little yeah or again we have lost the aorta all right there we go so just go forward and then we need to move on all right okay so that's is find the find the celiac all right moving on all right so that's it so the main lesion we are actually going to concentrate so this is the liver which we have already seen so just rotate it see what this is there's a hypoacuic lesion here so there's a hypoacuic lesion here so let's put a doppler there yeah okay all right now let's look at the stomach the endoscopic view and see where we have to go inflate the stomach yeah move on into the body yeah just pull this out air percent fit in air are you theek are you check kijiyega we go in we need to get a good uh, endoscopic view so that we know where that lesion is just inflate the stomach air ni air ni aari kisi stomach and plate ni aara so you yes you are on the posteriorly you posteriorly on the celiac trunk so you can see look at the endoscopic image air ni aari aari is ko tip ko down karke thoda lumen mein yeah we need to get a luminal view so we'll look at that tumor fine Yeah, there you go. We are probably still in the soft. Yes, yeah. Go down. Inflate. J. Kya baje? All right. So, so let's be inflated. Kya ho raha hai? 
ये चेक कर लें हम इसमें तो आ रही है सॉफिकस में अभी हम हर नहीं आना होना या देखो कुछ वॉश कर लीजिएगा या भी अगर स्टमक ना हो थोड़ा आगे करके इसको जस्ट इन्फ्लेट इट एंड देन देखो थोड़ा सा लेंस वॉश कर दीजिएगा वो उसके साथ लगा हुआ जी ये ठीक है इन्फ्लेट करें लेट्स फाइंड आउट वेयर दैट लीजन वॉज जी लीजन कहाँ थी एंट्रम में थी गैस कहाँ थी जी एंडोस्कोपिकली कहाँ थी पहले लेट्स फाइंड आउट या दिस सीम्स टू बी दिल्ली थोड़ा सा पीछे लाएँ या जस्ट गो टू दी एंट्रम एंड विल पुल बैक फ्रॉम देयर एंड सी वेर या टर्न इट ऑफ एंड सी इफ इट इज द फंडस ऑफ समथिंग और ये इसको तो नहीं ये ऊपर ये तो नहीं इसको तो नहीं पहले हाँ जी ऊपर कर लें सो वी ट्राइंग टू फाइंड आउट दैट सब बिकॉज लीजन तो शे बॉल पर लिखा था जी इन्फ्लेट कीजिए इन्फ्लेट कीजिए कैन यू सी इसका कोई इशू यहाँ से लीक ना करो आई थिंक अब करें किस जगह पे है किस जगह पे Yeah, could just pull back and see. Let's push the wall open. Yeah, we don't seem to be finding that region we are just looking for. Yeah, left to there. So let's uh, see the fold there. Okay. Yeah. Just approximate that, and let's let's look at the endoscopic image here. Yeah. It just looks like the pores there. Yeah. These are just the pores there. Yeah. Just approximate it, and then. Okay. So. Uh, the, uh, yeah. जी उसको करके टेप उसके ऊपर करके जस्ट स्लाइड इट एंड देन जस्ट लुक एट द एंडोस्कोपिक व्यू जस्ट या जेंटली अप्रॉक्सीमेटेड या यस अप्रॉक्सीमेटेड जेंटली पुल बैक पुल बैक वी नॉट सीइंग एनी लीजन देयर यू कैन सी द गैस यूएस का व्यू बड़ा कर देंगे थैंक यू या थोड़ा सा बड़ा कीजिएगा Yeah, but we're not okay. seeing any lesion there. The gastric wall seems to be okay there. Okay, sometimes, uh, as I said, when you're very close to the gastric wall, in cases of submucosal lesions, uh, you may not be able to see them. So you have to keep a distance, and usually that needs to water filling. But in this patient, we are not uh, going to do that because her airways are unstable. There's a chance of aspiration. So we just uh, trying to find it endoscopically and then approximate it, uh, but uh, we are still not able to see the lesion which was described on the posterior wall. Is this patient intubated now? Yeah, this is intubated now. Okay, well then, that case is okay. Yeah. So, yeah, I don't think so. That's the one because the gastric wall seems to be pretty okay, normal there on the endoscopic view. 
Yeah, just pull back a little up to the G junction and let's go again. Yeah, just keep an eye on that. Yeah, endoscopic view. That's just a bulge there. Yeah, okay. So as I said uh, previously in our discussion, they, sometimes they, sometimes you have an impression of a external. No, there was some swelling which we all yeah. feel yeah. there is. Yeah. Just yeah, just on this yeah there. Yeah, that's what I think. But when you put the transducer, keep going. Keep going. Yeah, yeah. yeah right just here. put it there. Yeah, put it there. Yeah, yeah. that's what we. Yeah, yeah, put it there. Right there. But as you see, if you look at the gastric wall here, if you look at the endoscopic image, it doesn't show anything there. So it seems that. Uh, it's an Im impression of an it, external viscera. It, uh, but we don't see a viscera there either. Yeah, so yeah. there has to be something. something either yeah. we got to show the viscera yeah, or we, shut it, uh, yeah, we have to I'm, show the that's lesion. A, yeah, that's what I'm trying to do. Yeah. We, uh, you know, if you look at the gastric wall, it doesn't seem to be anything there. Um, and, uh, so that's a normal, that's not a compression there. Yeah. Can you show the endoscopic view again? Yeah, just, just for yeah, one sec. Yeah, okay. there you go. So go a little bit down, a little bit down. Okay. With the scope. And yeah. now big wheel towards yeah. you. Yeah, tip up. Tip up. And just okay. pull back. Pull, pull back pull, from pull there. Back. Pull back slowly. Stop there, stop there and yeah. rotate to the right. Yeah. Turn right. And pull back. Yeah, that's one. Pull back. Yeah. Yeah, it doesn't sound like anything is there. Yeah, look at those, those layers are fine. It's right, uh, yeah, keep, keep pulling back. It, it is there, something is, uh, is there. Yeah, but, uh, yeah, the, I, I can see all the layers. And, uh, yeah, just keep on, right, rotate right and rotate left. Uh, slow, slow, very slow. Yeah, 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 this, okay, pull back a little, pull back a little, let's see, yeah. Okay, yeah, approximate it, yes. Just gently just rotate right and left. Gently, very gently. Mobile. Yeah, just let's go back again. I think it's just mobile. Yeah, that's, uh, we're missing maybe. it. Yeah, maybe. I don't know. I mean, uh, we are right on top of it, but we're not seeing anything. Can I try? Yeah, let me try this. Yeah. Now it's on the left side. Yeah. Right? But as you can see, I'm just trying to, yeah, that's there. I think maybe inflate again yeah. and take another. Yeah, let's take another look here. Yeah, that's why uh, the radial is sometimes better here because it has a balloon, so you have a overall 360 degrees view. Yeah, there's a balloon on this one too. But I, and there is a balloon on this yeah, one I'm too, right? Yeah, yeah there I'm it trying is. to inflate yeah. it now. seem to be let's pull back again and then see yeah there's suspicion here yeah okay let's see let's inflate the balloon here seeing anything here in spite of the balloon inflation. That's strange. There definitely seems to be a bulge there, but uh, There's definitely something yeah, there. Yeah. Uh, but uh, we can't see anything outside and we can't see anything in the wall. Let's see here. Yeah, again. Let's inflate the balloon again here. Let's see. Yeah, again you can we see. We have to take another look endoscopically. Yeah. Can you see 
Yeah, I think we will have to put a probably a inflate inflate the stomach and then inflate the stomach and let's take another look there. Is there a leak? Can you clean the balloon for now? Yeah, I'm just going to do it. Ah, air. I think it's air. It's not inflating. Yeah. Yeah, I think there's a problem with the yeah. Yeah. Yeah, I think it's here. Uh, this any ari. So there's a problem with the scope also, and it's not inflating it properly. This ka check kijiye. Yahan se to nahi leak kar rahi. Ah, ah, bar rakhe yahan. Yahan se, yahan se. If you look at your, look at your suction marks and there is a lesion here, you are distal to that. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. Uh, we're trying to inflate it a bit, a bit so that it becomes a little obvious. Yeah. yeah, right yeah, there. That, that's right. Yeah, that's that's the place here. Yeah. But again, Doctor, you, are you uh, push the scope in. A yeah, I'm doing that, and I'm pushing it in and out a Take little bit. Away from you, a little bit. Yeah. Uh -huh. Yeah, that's the big wheel away further. Yeah. That's strange. Can't see anything. You need to sweep there, it again. There, there, yeah. there, there, there's definitely a bulge there. Uh, uh, no, it's a big bulge. Huh. Yeah, okay. And what is it? Huh. Yeah, let's put a balloon up there now. Doesn't seem to help. Yeah, but I, I think I don't think it is in the wall actually. <coughs> Whatever it is, it should show. Yeah, it should it show. Should because it's either you got can, to be an organ see, there yeah. or it's got to be yeah. thickness yeah, in the look, mucosa. Look at, or look at the walls. The walls Quite don't nice, look thickened yeah. at all. Yeah. And uh, it's showing nicely here. And uh, we're right on it. Yeah, that's one. We're going sweeping again, sweep again here, and pull back, pull back, pull back here. Okay, there, there, there we are. Uh, oh no, oh no, this is again outside. Okay. No. Yeah, 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 there it is. Again, the wall, walls there is yeah, again, it's, it's away from the wall. Yeah. You know? It's a, yeah, uh, uh, there's something either compressing. Uh, yeah. yeah. You see, look at this. Yeah. Look at the it's wall. The wall is just over it. Yeah. Yeah, it's, it's something, something from outside, yeah. So the it's the wall is just, yeah. Yeah, so, uh, yeah uh, there's something uh, compressing, compressing it. Compressing it, yeah. So the wall is normal. So it's not a mucosal or submucosal lesion. Yeah, there's a definitely but yeah. yeah. Now at least you yeah. can see that yeah. there's something Yeah, and the wall is going over it. Yeah. I know. There you go. Yeah. And the wall is going over it. You can see that. Normal wall is the. Yeah. Wall is the. Yeah, that there. Yeah, yeah. The wall is normal. It's going over it. Yeah. That's it. This is the wall. Yeah. Something calcified. Yeah, we should need to look at. Uh, does this? Did this patient undergo a CT scan? I just asked that. I'm not sure. Did, yeah. did the guy? Uh, did, does the do the doctors know that? Yeah, there it is. Hold yeah, yeah, there, yeah. Just uh, there you go. Yeah. Did you see that? That yeah. right there. Yes, we yeah. can see it. Yeah, yeah. right there. But the is. wall is going over it. Yeah, right? and uh, it's uh, mm. the. Yeah, it possibly mm. could be an extrinsic, mm. uh, as yeah. a, like a, uh, arising from the gastric wall and uh, going outwards. But yeah. it's definitely, if you look at here, there is a, yeah. a mucosa, deep mucosa, mm. some mucosa, muscularis, and still there's some whitish yeah. uh, in tissue the cirrhosa, there. Yeah. So I think I agree it's in the cirrhosa, mm. that's yeah. what it yeah. is. So mm. we need to uh, probably do a CT scan on yeah. that. 
right. Uh, definitely right yeah. there. Yeah. Salad, what are the, uh, uh, Amjad, what are the possibilities? Yes, siro it's rising from the Siroza, it's unusual, but uh, sometimes the Shwanomas can uh, rise from there. Uh, would be very unusual though. And, uh, but it's calcified, so sometimes the tuberculomas, they can arise from yeah, any, any, any layer. Yeah, 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 granuloma. Uh, uh, like calcified calcified sort of yeah. granuloma. Which can Tuber arise from any. Tuberculous granuloma. Yeah. So this is a photo of the... Very difficult. Uh, but I'm, uh, yeah. I mean, if you can keep it still, so yes. Can I, you, can I, actually, the question is, can you take FNAs? Uh, it's going to be really it's hard. hard because it's this a is a mobile. This okay. is very mobile. Uh, can you, you can hear me, right? Yes, we can hear you. Okay. So here we have a. Uh, yeah. It's a CT or what is it? CT. Uh, no, it's a MRI, right? Yeah, it's CT. So CT report ah, is ah. there is a focal area yeah. of soft tissue right. thickening with calcific hyperdense focus seen within the posterior wall of the stomach. Yeah. So this is exactly what we are seeing. Yeah. Uh, calcified yeah. and uh, it's, it's uh, a, uh, yeah. alongside the posterior wall. Yeah. Uh, yeah, if you can see, this is the calcified the plaque. Is, yeah. uh, Normal, uh, yeah. There. So this, this seems to either it's adherent or either it is arising from the cirrhosis. Okay. So I think we can take this picture here and yeah. Uh, So, uh, I don't know if we can take a picture there. Uh, I think they have good I think we got a good picture. Yeah. Oh, okay. Great. Jim and Ram. It's going to actually fall down your scope. Right yeah. Here. Yeah. It's right in the posterior wall. Yeah. Here we go. There you go. So it's right up there. As you as you pull back, there you go. There it is. Uh, there it is. As you can see, there. Uh, it's hyperaquic. There's an acoustic shadowing there, but it's mainly hypoaquic there. There. It just slips. Yeah. Uh, yeah, 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 that's the one. Right there, yeah. you can yeah, see just, that? Yeah, just, just let's measure it. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, oh, we need to sign that because it just slips away. Okay. It's slipping away. Sorry, yeah. Sorry. Yeah. Yeah. Uh -huh. sure. yeah. So, uh, uh, the way uh, really when you do, uh, whenever uh, you do uh, uh, this examination of uh, some mucosal lesion, you can see that it's right there. So take your scope right towards the upper end, endoscopically rotate it, try to bring it upwards, and then big wheel towards you, and uh, then you have to rotate it uh, a little bit. Right there, you see that big shadow now? Right there. Everybody yeah. sees it? Yeah, I think this is This, this is, is the, it. Yeah. Right there, and this is the a hole, yeah. that's a, and the same way the bulge is like that too yeah, in the, the stomach. Yeah. Yeah. That's the calcification right here. So a calcification yeah. shell, and this is all yeah. shadow, shadow from it. Yeah, acoustic shadow. Right. Yeah. So this is the one. Uh, uh, Sadhbe, can you hear me? No. Can you hear yes, me? Yes, we can okay. see and hear clearly. Yeah, yeah. so yeah. it's a, a calcific shell around that. And if you pay attention to this EUS image and then go back to the endoscopic image, they correspond to each other. I'm sitting right on top of it uh, endoscopically. You see that? We can't see the endoscopic can, view. Can you show the endoscopic view, please? We can see it now. Yeah. You see right there on top of it, I'm, I'm going in, big wheel towards me, rotating the scope to the right. And then just a little bit torquing, and you see I'm right on top of it. So it is a calcified, uh, some structure calcified. If likely when they be become calcified like this, usually it's a benign lesion. And it looks like a maybe yeah. a big granuloma. Yeah. I uh, don't know. Uh, 
Uh, exactly, and here we are. Uh, you're right. Uh, uh, like the, all the wall layers yeah. appear intact. Intact, yeah. So it's uh, coming off the serosal layer yeah. of the stem, yeah. and uh, I, I actually. Uh, uh, there is a uh, tissue. Uh, Can you just show the wall layers for the yeah. audience, please? Yes. So here, uh, uh, one thing before I go back to the wall layers, I'm going to show you that in a minute. But remember, this is muscularis, okay? I'll show you a, 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 those layers a little better. And this is that uh, abnormality or a mass, whatever you want to call it. So here, to show you the actual wall layers. This first one, this is all balloon, anechoic balloon, fluid in the balloon. And then the next is the uh, white. The first white is, uh, it's a uh, uh, approximation of the balloon to the mucosa itself. And then you see the black, that's a muscularis mucosa, then submucosa and other white, and then muscularis propria, and then serosa. If we see the same thing in the uh, uh, mediastinum, then this would be adventitia. And if you are seeing in the peritoneum or intra-abdominal, so that's a serosa. And that's coming off this white, you uh, like, mm. you saw that. Yeah. Yes, and you can see here, same, uh, actually nice image as well, but you see uh, mucosa, deep mucosa, submucosa, muscularis mucosa, and this is a capsule of the liver right there, mm. serosa and capsule of the liver right there. So we are in a different place. And just topically, if I go back to the same area, I just want to show that again, you take a look at endoscopically, be on the proximal end of that lesion, make your balloon big, big will towards you, lean onto that, and you are right on top of it, right here. Clear? Any questions? Yeah, we need to uh, maybe. Uh, yes, we'll That's it. it. Uh, yeah. Thank you. Yeah, yeah. I, FNA won't be helpful. Yeah. That yeah. needle won't go through yeah. that calcified yeah. uh, uh, shell. Yeah, and it will be very mobile. So it will very be very mobile difficult. too, yeah. and it's not going to be. And doesn't look bad anyway. So. Yeah. Okay. Thank you very much. Okay. So. Yeah. 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 It's not a, yeah. it is attached. That's uh, very to interesting, this. Uh, yeah, interesting. It's uh, like attached to the yeah. stem, uh, I guess. We'll no, no, all, just go ahead. Just do a yeah, some examination. Yeah. yeah, just do oh, the. We can, uh, yeah. I'm the freeze oil. Oh, sorry. Just do the exam. Just go to the, just go to the duodenum. Uh, just uh, the. Uh, there you go. Just go to the duodenum and uh, look at the portal vein and all those things. Uh, but uh, five minutes more. Just look at the duodenum and then coming out. Huh? Yeah, sure. Uh, we'll just yeah. We'll just take the Okay, we need to quickly do that and then come come out. Okay? I think you'll have, to, you'll have to zoom out because you're yeah. still zooming in. All right, there we go. Where is that? It's covered at depth, huh? yeah. Oh. It's covered at depth, Zoom, come on. It's big, right? Image, 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 check. Just go to the duodenum. Look at the port vein. Yeah, just wedge yourself between one. Yeah, pull back a little. D1, D2 ke darmiyan. Yeah, look at, uh, yeah, come back. Look at the D1, D2. Look at the superior duodenal angle. Wedge there and turn yourself to the left. Yeah, drop your scope. Yeah, yeah. Find the portal vein. Yeah, you're out of it. Dwara jana pade. There you go. Yeah, that's that's the pancreas coming up. Yeah, thoda sa. Uh, ji, thoda sa. Yeah, lower right, left, right, left. 
रोटेट करें हाँ जी सी वे यू आर सो दैट या गो बैक सी वे डी वन डी टू अंदर है बाहर या दस दस से हंड्रेड पेंट किया सो दिस इज द पेंट कैरेट डाक दे जी पिछले इफ यू लॉस्ट ऑलवेज कम बैक टू दी द स्टेशन वे यू Yeah, there you go. So, if you're lost, just spend one minute or two minutes there, and then come back always to the familiar station. Right there. Yeah, come back. Doesn't matter. And come back. Yeah, this is a D one. Tip up, tip towards yourself. Big wheel towards yourself. Rotate left. Find the portal vein. Yeah, just turn right, left. You need to find the portal vein. There you are. So, first thing you should find is the portal vein. Once you found the portal vein, then you're good. You're out because. Sort of like a kind. And let's look at the endoscopically. Yeah, there, there you go. That, so that's the gall bladder there. So if you turn, keep on turning left. There you go. That's the gall bladder, right? Now, right. turn back. Look at the gall bladder. Yeah. Now slowly rotate towards your right shoulder. There you go. That's the liver. Keep on doing that. Oh, that's the kidney. Okay, that's too much rotation, I think. Okay, which one? What are you doing? Right. So what you need to do is. Okay, what is that? Okay, so I think we need to finish up here. Patient is not sedated anymore. Sir, patient is ready to go. Aye. All right. So, yeah. Okay, patient is come. जी पेशेंट पे सुडेशन खत्म कर दिए हाँ जी मैं हालात में नहीं फिनिश कर So uh, there you go. You need to go into the second part of the duodenum. Okay, sir. There, go on to the papilla. You shorten your scope. Okay, sir. Here, you have to shorten it. Find the pancreas. Slowly come back. Release them. Ye jo na, always release this. Okay, sir. अपने आप को just turn yourself right. As you shorten the scope, turn yourself towards right so that you have a stable position. A little bit. Tip up. Approximate it to the duodenum. Yeah. And slowly, right and left, find the vessels. First, you have to find the aorta. Either find the aorta or find the ampulla. Slowly, slowly, slowly. Tip up, and then as required. Yeah. Just try to find the vessels. Or uh, yeah, just keep on pulling back. Yeah, you need to find the vessels, or you need to find the. So it's just yeah. keep coming back. Ah, uh, the yeah. slow, slow. Yeah, uh, uh, suction, air suction, suction, air. Right, uh, tip up. Yeah, you you just have to approximate it to the wall, and uh, yeah, yeah, just find the structure slowly, slowly. Find the pen here. There you go. Yeah, yeah, there. Okay. Come back a little. Tip up. Yeah, there's a lot of air, so this this interfering. Yeah, just keep suction on that. Tip up. Approximate it to the wall. Slowly. Yeah. So here you either have to find the aorta, or you have to find the ampulla, which is the kissing. What we call as the kissing technique, kissing the ampulla technique. So if you don't find them, you go again go back. Do you think we come back enough? Uh, Haan, chal, aajan. Just pull back. Yeah, need to find either the pancreas or you need to find either the 
the vessels. Yeah. Right. Okay. So, see where you are. Yeah, that, you see, the, but you have to, yeah, orient it properly so that, you know, it doesn't sort of slip out or, yeah, go back again. This will process to do that way. If you come out, just go back again. Huh? That should inflate current for us. Approximate to the wall, pull back. Yeah, see that? Are you kidding the line? Should be like in the point is that means just you have rotated too much. You can rotate to the other side. Yeah. Yeah, there, there you go. Yeah, you know, we'll start finding the presses now. So, you know, slowly and gradually this right and left rotation, find the straight, this is the liver, that's the gall bar, fine. Yeah, that's a great vessel, I think. Uh, Doppler, where is the Doppler? Where is the Doppler? Viva? Flow, yeah, flow on. Do you see that? These are the great vessels. Yeah. Full bar, gradually keeping it in view. Yeah. That's the Ota in a Keva. Keep on coming back. Yeah. Now turn yourself. If you turn clockwise, you start seeing the Thank you. Yeah. yeah, just turn a little left. Left or right? Yeah. You, you, once you have the aorta, yeah. you take the aorta as a landmark. So if you turn clockwise from it, you will start seeing the pancreas and bilateral the pancreas and all things. If you turn left side, you will see the vena cava and the kidney. So this is turning right mm -hmm. clockwise. Yeah, clockwise, you see the start seeing the pancreas, right? Slowly, gradually pull back. Yeah, it takes a little time to, you know, identify the structures and all those things. Yeah. yeah. The idea is just to familiarize you. There you go. Okay, just keep on pulling back. Identify the structures. Yeah. Okay. Now, once you've fallen back into the stomach, you just continue. Uh, yeah. Have you? Okay. Yeah. Pishy Pishy Pishy. Pishy. yeah. All right. So just go back to the uh, aorta and go we'll back orient ourselves. Yeah. Aorta basa. Yeah. Pull back Achha. onto the ciliac axis and all right. From there, we'll orient again. So as I said, whenever you're lost, you just pull back to a familiar station and you orient yourself again. Okay? So find the aorta. So for the aorta, you will go back to the T-junction area and then... Yeah, then. yeah. Just come back. This, you know, you're, you're looking at the stomach here. So just come back. Yeah, there you go. Just follow the aorta. You see, you're right on the liver now. Yeah. Iski bata, kare zara kam kare na iski magnification. 
ये मैग्नीफाई हुआ हुआ ना जूम हुआ हुआ नहीं चो, इमेज छोटा करना है छोटा नहीं ओके नाउ अब करें सो वेर आर यू नाउ सो यू नो दैट्स द लेवर सो नाउ टर्न योर सेल्फ पीछे आ जाए स्कोप स्ट्रेट करें टर्न योर सेल्फ नाइन्टी डिग्रीज गो ऑन टू दी ओटा से ठीक है पुश पुश इन टू साइड बस नहीं वो ठीक मैग्नीफाई था एक एक अब बहुत छोटा हो गया थोड़ा एक मैग्नीफाई करें बस अच्छा फाइंड द ओटा Keep the yota in view. Yeah, keep the yota in agi agi chalenge. So this is the pleura. That means you and the soft is the side. Right. Uh, keep the yota. This so bring the yota into view. Yeah. Ab push it in. Keep the yota in view. Yahan se pakna. तो आपका स्कोप नहीं जा रहा बहुत पीछे से पकड़ रहे हो तो स्कोप बेंड हो रहा है यहाँ से ठीक है दूसरी तरफ ले सो दैट्स द हार्ट सो द स्कोप इज नाउ रोटेटेड एंटीरियरली राइट सो द योटा इज पोस्टीरियरली सो आप यहाँ से रोटेट कर रहे हो सो so, आपको आदत पड़ी हुई है स्कोप की ठीक है दिस इज नॉट द राइट वे टू है सो द वो जो हम बात कर रहे थे ना द मूवमेंट हैज़ टू बी एट द शोल्डर पे सीधा सीधा सो द मूवमेंट हैज़ टू बी एट द शोल्डर सो इफ़ यू मूव पोस्टीरियरली सो द स्कोप इज स्ट्रेट ना ठीक है ना यू कैन यू कैन या सीधा जस्ट लेट्स योर लेफ्ट हैंड डू द जॉब एंड जस्ट विद द राइट हैंड इज द पुश इट और ठीक है ना इट्स ओके जस्ट मूव योर लेफ्ट हैंड विद द लेफ्ट हैंड कीप दिन व्यू ठीक है जी दूसरी तरफ करें दूसरी तरफ करें दूसरी तरफ ये विद दिस हैंड कीप दोट एंड व्यू दैट हैंड पुश ट्रेन यार सुन रहे डिफिकल्ट राइट लेकिन ये देखें उसमें होता है कि वंस यू हैव दोट एंड व्यू ये देखें राइट हैंड से सिर्फ पुश हैंड्स मूवमेंट्स प्लीज या सो जस्ट पुश द पुश इट विद राइट जी कैन कैन दे शो कैन दे शो ये ठीक है ठीक है जस्ट जस्ट यूज दिस ये देखें जस्ट यूज दिस टू पुश लेफ्ट हैंड टू और ये ठीक सो लेफ्ट हैंड राइट हैंड इफ यू डू दैट दिस विल मूव द अवे फ्रॉम द योटा और ऑन द योटा और यू नो इट विल रोटेट द स्को बट दिस इज यूज टू पुश द स्को सो दिस इज दिलेक्ट राइट दैट द क्रॉस ऑफ द डाया फ्राम राइट अबाउट दैट That's the cross of the diaphragm. That's the aorta. That's the ciliate, right? And as you go, so it divides very well. Right, right, spending, right. Then as you go, you'll be right on the pancreas there, right? So if you come on the ciliate, just rotate further towards your right shoulder, and you will start seeing the adrenal and the spleen and the kidney. Huh? If you just There you go. That's the adrenal, right? And as you rotate further, that's the left kidney. Rotate further, that's the spleen, and pull it up, right? So there you go. All right, again. So come. I'm going to go back to the aorta. Yeah. So if you have an adrenal, this is the kidney, right? So the kidney comes when you're rotating medially. So if you rotate to the opposite side you will start seeing the structures where we work yeah see okay. so just this is the way so at g junction pe jo movement hai that's very just use this movement to get to all the structures so adrenal kidney spleen ciliac just use it here just use this Right. Without using the. जी थोड़ा सा जेंटली आते जाएं और स्ट्रक्चर देख के आ जाएं ठीक है ओके